All right, YouTube and Fallout community. So welcome back to the, another episode of Fallout 3. We're on episode two, obviously. Um, this is just me questing around Megaton, and I'm just picking up the uh, the you know, kind of following the main quest, getting trying to get the info from Moriarty. Uh, you can pay him 100 caps for the information. But, you know, at the beginning of the game, you don't really have a whole lot of caps. Like, you have just a couple hundred, unless you've already, like, raided a bunch and sold a bunch. So, instead of paying him the 100 caps, you can go collect the money from this chick named, I think, Silver? I think is what her name is. Um, and you, you go talk to her. She lives out by, uh, Springville? Right? I think, yeah, Springville. Um, which is, like, the town, the town you kind of walk through on your way to Megaton. There's like Springville, there's Springville School around the area, Guilty and then there's like, there's her house, which is kind of like an unmarked you location, I'm gonna help you and out. For old time's sake. I think that's kind of all in the general area, the and you go in there and you can talk to her, which, you, which you'll see right here, and then favorable. you can either like convince her to give you some caps, to, so you don't have to kill her, and just tell Moriarty that she's dead or whatever, or she's taken care of rather, and then you can, um, and then come back to Moriarty and like turn it in, or, what I, <laughs> which is what I do, is have her pay me to tell Moriarty that she is, um, like gone, take care of, take whatever, and then you can turn her around after she gives you the caps and just kill her, and just loot her body, because that's what I do, because <laughs> it's like, you get more caps that way, because she gives you however much caps, and then you can find a hundred caps on her, on her dead body, and it's like, she is literally fucking irrelevant to anything and everything ever. You don't even get, I don't even believe you get, get bad karma for killing her, because she's so, she's that irrelevant to the world. Not even the world cares about her. Not even the in-game guy watching you do good and bad things gives a shit. So she's obviously a bitch, though. You hear her talking right here? Look, I don't know who you are. I'm not just handing over my life's earnings to you. Bitch, yeah, you are. You just don't know it yet. You do that for me. Yeah, I'm a sweet guy. That's what I do. Thanks, kid. You're all right. Yeah, I'm. I'm a pretty sweet guy. Definitely a sweet guy. Watch this epic fail. Oh, what? Two percent. The last shot gets her. She wasn't ready. <laughs> but yeah, this, that's the best way to do it. It's more fun that way. Like, if you just gave Moriarty a hundred caps, how boring, right? He's like, here's hundred caps. Oh, your dad's uh, your dad's over at GNR. It's like, okay, what the fuck. So, um, but yeah, this video would be a little bit longer, guys. But um, are you just thirsty, or are you ready? I uh, like, there's not a lot of quests here. Like, I only show two quests, a little small quest, whatever, for a uh, megaton. Because the only real other quest in this town is the Wasteland Survival Guide. And I think that I think that'd be better as like doing have all the Wasteland Survival Guide done as like one single video, just every quest like back to back. So that's probably what I'll do with the Wasteland Survival Guide instead of adding it on to this one because I just said there's no reason to. Now I'm starting I'm starting off a little little bit slow pace, you know. I'm not doing like super super long videos right out the gate, but I am building up. The, the first video was only like four minutes, but that's only because it's Christmas, you know. <laughs> like I can't. You know, record super long videos and do voiceovers and shit whenever it's Christmas time and there's family around. But, uh, so yeah, I do this one, get the information right here from Moriarty. He's pretty much a piece of shit. I'm gonna steal all of his money from his safe. He just doesn't know it yet. I'm gonna steal his fucking key from him and get, get his fucking caps and whatever else he may have in his, like, safe thing. And then, next up, we're gonna go chill over at Walter. Walter's place. Get a little questy, questy poo from him. He just, uh, he doesn't know it yet. What's up, Walter? What What's going mean? on, man? Your world has treated you wrong. You look harsh, my friend. Well, Holy God. No this quest was actually... Uh, I remember this from when, I when I did my first playthrough. I, spend so much time I for the life, life of me, could not find the three fucking now, leaky parts of the pipe. And <laughs> <but if> you, <laughs> you had to, like, patch you know up that the that three, three parts. I've memorized these days. Like, I can just go do it without even hesitating. I know exactly where they're at. But when I first played some Fallout 3, like, maybe even my first few playthroughs, I don't know if I ever even... Completed this. It's not even really a quest because you don't even get like an actual quest for it. It's just kind of like an unmarked quest to do. But yeah, I always remembered where to go. Right here. It's like, this is right by Walter, right here. <coughs> Here's a little guidey. A little guidey poo. I'm, I'm using poo at the end of everything right now. A little guidey poo on how to get all the three leaky, leaky pipe parts of the pipe if you haven't ever uh, found it. You do need a repair of 30, which I had to, had to go level up a little bit because at level 2 I didn't have 30 repair. 
Man, Megaton was such a cool location, man. They, I really wish there was something along the lines of this in, like, Fallout 4, or any, any kind of, like, future, like, Fallout game or something. It's a really interesting location, like, because there's no other really, there, I mean, Rivet City's kind of got some verticality, but in, when it comes to Fallout 3, there's not a whole lot of places that are, like, this, like, tall, you know? Especially when it comes to major towns, like, towns themselves. There's, like, tall buildings and things, but when it comes to actual towns and settlements, or whatever you want to call them, there's not a whole lot like this, except for maybe Rivet City. And, uh, New Vegas definitely didn't have, like, any of them. They had a couple tall buildings, like, in, like, New Vegas or whatever. New Vegas location, I mean. But. So, yeah, that's, uh, what is it? episode two of my well, Fallout 3 playthrough, guys. The pressure's up in the um, path. again, I'm trying to do, I'll be trying to do these daily. And they're gonna get a little bit longer. I mean, I'm not gonna shoot for, like, you know, listen, maybe 15 max. I'm not gonna shoot for, like, super, super long videos, because they'd be, like, super, it'd be, like, complicated as hell to upload. But, yeah, it's episode two, guys. Thanks for watching. Later. If I have a steady supply of scrap, I can keep the plant run- Good! This just keeps looking better. Those parts will keep this place-